Hi everyone, I'm Sar, one of the curriculum developers at CodePath, and I'm here to tell you about the CodePath's Android Pathway. This pathway consists of two levels, Android 101 and Android 102. Let's talk about each of them. In Android 101, students discover Android for the first time. From day one, you'll build practical skills using Android Industries' preferred IDE, Android Studio, and the preferred programming language, Kotlin. Each unit will work with real Android apps, practicing Kotlin, building layouts, and writing code that ties it all together. By the fourth unit, you'll be able to make your own fully functional Android apps from scratch. From there, we'll work on introducing additional features, such as networking and list views, to make your apps even better. By the end of the course, you'll work in a small group to create an app of your own design and share it with the class during demo day. For Android 102, students with basic Android knowledge will focus on taking their apps to the next level. During the first three units, you'll build increasingly complex Android apps, developing a solid foundation and core concepts you'll need to succeed. By the fourth unit, we'll start diving into intermediate Android concepts to take your apps to the next level. We'll look at multi-page apps, offline storage using databases, and using fragments to create more complex app layouts. At the end of the course, you'll get a chance to prove your skills, working in a small group to create an app of your own design and share it with the class during demo day. As for some logistics, both courses are 10 units long, with each unit consisting of a lesson, lab, and project. The lessons are 30 to 60 minutes long and consist of discussion, instructor demos, and some context on the topic. In the lab, you'll get to try things out, learning through doing and collaborating with your peers on a 60 to 90 minute in-class activity that's ungraded. Then you'll do your project, which you will complete outside of class individually, and it's a chance to show what you've learned and to use some real tools and create a real app. For tech requirements, because we use industry quality tools, you'll need to make sure that your device meets the requirements. The most important one is either 16 gigabytes of RAM or eight gigabytes of RAM plus an external Android device. Excited? Once you apply, you'll be placed in one of the levels and given access to the pre-work assignment. The pre-work is a short mandatory task that helps us assess your readiness for the course and helps you determine if the course is right for you. For Android 101, your pre-work will involve setting up Android Studio, downloading a sample app and running it on your computer. You'll also answer some creative questions about what apps you might want to build. For Android 102, your pre-work will involve building a simple app from scratch. Don't worry, we guide you through it in case your skills are rusty. Thank you so much for your interest in the Android pathway at CodePath. For more information, please check out our website or reach out to admissions at codepath.org. Bye.